After we've done our cold extrusion line, product then needs to be twinned. So this can be however many cores the finished cable is going to be. So it's between two here and four. This is our twinning machine. Can't see inside it right now, but if you're looking through this window with the camera, you'll see two bows that are spinning round and the drums are paid off through the bows and then it's like twisting together, it's quite cool. So when it stops, you might be able to have a look at it again. After they've been through here, they'll be tested by an operator. This test sheet lives with the cable, so we'll go over to where the finished cable stays. These are all our twinned cables. So after they've come off the insulation line and then twin, they'll be together in this twisted pair. This testing information will live with the cable until it becomes a finished product. Traceability all the way through the factory. When they're placed here, somebody from final test will come and check them just to make sure the operator is 100% right with what the test is, ensuring quality product every time. These are all the input stands into our twinning machine. So this is part of a massive new investment we've had. So these are all new uh, driven payoff stands. These are slightly bigger than the ones that you see on the insulation line because they handle slightly heavier products and drums now. So you can have up to four running at any one point and then a fifth one for the CPC on earth wire which can be twinned in with the other products. You can see here one, two, three, four and five driven payoff stands. 